from being a high school offensive superstar to being a defensive player in college? Well, it, it wasn't hard, i say, physically, but mentally it's a lot of work, like getting the coverages and yeah. switching everything up because now I'm actually holding the guy I used to be, so that helps me. Yeah. But physically, it's not that bad. So it helps you being yeah. a receiver, being a receiver, being, and, and uh, get the routes to put off the line? Where do we have? Yeah. A lot has been made about the you and Bryson being thrown into the fire after having limited playing time last year. How do you think y'all responded to that? I, I think we're doing pretty good. I mean, I can't say for the coaches what they think, but I think we're doing pretty good. It's our first year doing it, really actually doing it. I think we're getting better, and that's all we can do. Defense has given up a lot of points this year. You think that's a scheme factor, an experience factor, or just the high team offenses that y'all played so far? Well, I mean, we played some pretty good teams, but really it comes down to us, the execution, the scheme. All right. Uh, do you think that moving the Texas A&M game back to the middle of the year instead of playing it the first game has affected y'all any? Y'all's mindset going in? Not really. I mean, we got to focus on one game at a time and just take it week by week. All right, and uh, if y'all win this week, do you think that uh, going up against a one-loss SEC opponent, going in undefeated, y'all can stay focused? I mean, that's, that's always the task at hand, is staying focused week by week, not taking any opponent lightly. But, yeah, I think we'll keep our focus. All right, thank you. Good talk to you. Thank you.